next match we have Sparks White or Mitchell versus Byron slash Rijo. This one's gonna be fun. That was a very close match. It was neck and neck between both of Destination and the Hero, but unfortunately that last stream absolutely destroyed Chillax and gave BTC the win. Why am I stopping this up? We have Sparkzoid versus Widjo! First match will be the same as the first match of the last one, Destination Expert 15! Uh, Going through the Destination again. Both players have a very good score. Widjo has a 996. Sparkzoid has not played this in a while, but he definitely knows the chart. These guys have had an opportunity to look at the chart on the last set, so if they remembered any of the gimmicks, they might be able to get an advantage here. This is going to be interesting. Both players are getting prepared. Just about to change and optimize their settings. And we will get into the second loser's quarters. Never mind, we're going straight away! Let's see how it goes. Both players piercing. Sparkzoid's two EX ahead. Sparkzoid's picked up the first break, which is still holding on to his piercing. Sparkzoid is still around five EX ahead, which has picked up a great. Sparkzoid's MA is phenomenal, giving him a 10 EX lead, 15 EX. He does mess up the transition though, and that gives Widjo a lead of 10 EX. Widjo has just dropped that lead. It's a round even now. I think Widjo's around 5x ahead. Widjo unfortunately knows a lot of the stops here. Sparkzoid does not. That might give Widjo the advantage he needs to win this match against Sparkzoid's phenomenal MA. Widjo around 45x ahead. Widjo, 80 EX ahead. Still holding on to his great SC. Sparkzoid has broken multiple times on the stop and the technical elements of this chart. Sparkzoid, again, the, the real deficit here is that he did not know, he does not know this chart, but Widjo knows this chart very well. And unfortunately, that's going to come back to fight Sparkzoid, and he's going to have to win the next two matches. Because there is no way he's going to come back with Widjo still holding his great football number. Widjo does break his full combo, but he still has a near 200. 200 um, the X lead. Widjo 150 points. Losing a bunch of his lead at the end, but it did not matter as his lead was so high. Nearly triple A as well.
Yeah, we're good, man. I'll be fine. You gotta dance with your mind, not your legs. That's true. This is gonna be interesting. Both players do have a good score on the 17. It is really gonna come down to stamina. Now. We chose 1 0 against Mato. Let's go! Wizard needs to take this set to be able to beat it and get on to the loser's semis. Tear it up, y'all! Wizard getting a great very early, same with Spark Toys. But Spark Toys having around a 10 EX difference in his favor. Wijo breaking that spot to his team in his FC. Because of that spot to gets around a 50 EX difference. In his favor, of course. Mitchell still holding on to his FC. The stream there, they both play phenomenally. Wijo's only around 15 to 10 EX behind. This is a very close match. Anyone can take it. Mitchell does break. Byron, Wijo comes back in the lead just slightly because of that stop. Wijo breaks, giving Spark Toys an advantage. This man is very tiny, only around 10 EX. This is anyone's game. Spark Toys is about 30 EX ahead. Spark Toys break, giving some of that advantage back to Wijo. Looks like this is in favor of Spartoids. Spartoids 50 EX ahead. This is going to go down to round 3, it seems. You can do it. Yep, Spartoids 70 EX ahead. This is going to go to round 3. Oh, is it? Wait a minute. Good potential. Spartoids is holding on. I'm pretty sure he's going to take round 2. Just as an anti up. Oh, wait. This is still going? Wow, never mind. Uh, over 100 EX ahead, though. Mitchell is holding on phenomenally. There we go, there's the ending. 116 EX lead. One to one, Haraido will be the tiebreaker. This, this is gonna be very interesting. Wijo has a lot of experience with this chart. I'm not sure about how much Mitchell has. The issue, the issue is that Wijo is more used to the 15 challenge, which are shock arrows, but Mitchell is more used to the expert 15. This is a huge drill chart. What is going to set these players apart is they can keep consistently hitting that BPM, because easily these players can have seen both of these charts at the same time. But now, more or less, the issue is can both these players keep up their accuracy? Her insane accuracy from both of these players. This is going to be a close one. These players shaking hands before the game. Great sportsmanship from these two players. Both amazing games today, playing phenomenally. Here we go, first drills. Mitchell breaking. Wizard PSC giving him a 5 EX lead. Wow, Wizard is playing phenomenally. Holding a PLC on these streams is much harder than it seems. Wizard getting his first break, but either way, still having a 10 EX difference. Spark Toys catching up, still keeping out 10 EX difference despite his early up hits. Which are still holding on to his great effort. Around a 15 EX lead in favor of Wijo. We're gonna go back into the streets in a second, this is the end of the slow section. That was perfect! Ooh, I saw Mitchell get a lot of great damage. Extend the lead from Wijo up to 50. Wijo's consistent. On the stream, 
is amazing. We're about to get into the end stream. This is a very long stream. One mistake could break someone's tournament match. Which are playing phenomenally. Mitchell getting a lot of great. Widjo is going to take it. Widjo getting an 80, no, 60 EX difference. Phenomenal play from Widjo. Widjo's experience with Horido really does show that. His consistency to be able to get amazing MOs on those drills. Sparks always, unfortunately, on the last stream, got a lot of grades and a ruinous chance of coming back. But either way, phenomenal plays from both players. Either way, we are going to get 